<laughs> okay, so welcome back to the Hungry Popper. I am the Hungry Popper, and I thank you for showing up. I have a look what's going on, and we are going to do a little side dish here, a little salad. Now I have not had this dish since I was a child and it's, so, and it's probably been late 70s, extremely early 1980s, but we used to have it all the time back then. And there's the cucumbers. Now I like to peel all that old bitter peeling off of there myself. Get rid of it. So there's that. So let's go ahead and, and slice these real quick here. Just slice them into a nice uh, eating, a decent, uh, civilized thickness, you know. And I promise you, these make a nice little salad. This is going to be uh, cucumbers and onions in a creamy dressing. You may have had it as a child, or maybe even maybe even recently. So give me a comment if you've had if you've had this recently, because it's kind of gone out of vogue. Uh, leave me a note down below down in the comment section there guys. I appreciate you So there's Trying to get to keep these slices into a, a Civilized thickness So that it looks like uh, They're ready for about anybody so there's the slices and um out by uh, my eyeball but if you can measure it if you want to I don't care so we've got some meal left over in here that we need to go ahead and and use so let's see if we can get it out of there some more. there's some of that about time to use that mayo up. And I've got some store brand mayo that I've never really cared for a whole lot, but it'll work. It'll work for this. Let's put that in there. There you go. Let's do that for now and see what we got. Used to hear that a lot from my mother. Do this or that for now and see what we got. Let's go ahead and whisk this together. Oh yeah. Mayo and uh, sour cream, equal parts or approximately there of, approximately. Let's shake that vinegar up to get the mother going in there. Put a little bit of vinegar to it. There's that. Kind of thin that down just a smidge. And let's just have a little. Works. I'm going to need to thin it out just a, just a hair. I think this would be about right for that little pile of cucumbers in that bowl right there. I think we need a little bit more, more acidity back to it. Let's do that. Let's put some salt and pepper. And we need some, I don't know, that little 
salt shaker that's a pain in the dairy air. Let's just put a little salt in there like that. Where did I get this from? That'll work. Now I know there are recipes out there where they put fancy herbs and stuff in there. If you want to do that, you have that. Salt and pepper and just the basic dressing is good for me. Okay. That will work. So let's just pour it over there. find other recipes besides the one I just gave you for this and if you want to do that you know what I'm sure there's a lot of good ones out there but that's what was told to me let me wash my hands real quick here but this is a nice Recipe for a little cell. Oh, I forgot the onions. I forgot the freaking onions. I forgot the onions. Let's, we gotta have an onion in there, guys. We cannot have. That, that, I knew that in my mind there was something missing. There's a little onion, a little sweet onion. Let's put that baby in there. It doesn't feel like it's never too late. Okay, so there's, there's a knife, Cut the, both sides off of that onion, both ends of it off I should say, get rid of those stuff in between there, and get rid of this part. There, now. I don't know that we want whole slices of onion, so let's just do that. has to sit in the fridge and make for a while you know get let the flavors kind of mingle so not that many onions in there really It'll be all right. so we almost forgot our onions give us a fork and forker here That's pretty good. If you want a little side dish to go with grilled burgers or whatever, and your cucumbers, now this does need to sit. So it needs to be made, you know, a little while ahead of time.
There it is. I appreciate you stopping by. And we'll see you on the next one, guys. Thank you. Bye-bye.